This may be a really good microphone and the most portable. What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. I just picked this up. It's my Samsung, and it's the Meteorite, and that's because it kind of looks like a little Meteorite. But I picked this up because the Samsung microphones that I've had in the past have been pretty good, and I'm looking for something to go on the road with me, but I want it to be pretty small. I've got plenty of mics that are really big, have a big footprint, take up a lot of space in my luggage, and I don't want that. I'm looking for the smallest thing possible that gives me decent audio quality so I can still do meetings so I can record videos so that I can live stream with you from time to time so here is what it looks like now it's kind of interesting because it's two pieces and it's kind of low tech in that way but it actually makes a lot of sense so first of all we get the microphone and this little base right here and everything is this chrome plastic it's not metal but there is a weight here in the bottom we do have a little rubber ring on the bottom here so it should kind of stand in place you can see a little cutout here for the cable and then here is the Meteorite microphone itself. So I've got a little cable on it, just standard USB plug. I'd call this about three feet, about a yard. So it's not super long, but it's gonna be perfect for using with a laptop. And then we have the Meteorite microphone right here. Now I will say, it kind of reminds me of one of those old school microphones, you know? The old school radio microphones, it's got a nice unique look, some big horizontal cuts here, the grill in the back. Again, fake chrome but plaster chrome all the way around here. Now I do think this is a cardioid condenser mic, so if you aim it towards yourself, it's gonna pick up where you're speaking in here. So it's not meant to be an omnidirectional microphone per se. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and plug it in here because I think it has a 14 millimeter pickup right in there. You can see the little dot right there. I think that is the LED status light on it. There aren't any dials or anything like that. This is really meant to be kind of your basic mic, but if you look at the size of this, it's kind of like a large golf ball smaller than your typical light bulb and it's not that big so what i think is between this and this it'll pack nicely in my luggage but then when you are using this on your desk what you can see is it'll drop in there now i will say there is a magnet in there it's holding the sucker in it does allow it to rotate nicely but you also don't have to worry about it kind of just rolling out like the autobots roll out so what I can do here is just drop it in here and then angle it up to me. So if this is on the desk, I would angle it up a little higher. If I had it stacked on books or something like that, I would angle it directly towards me. So it's a nice looking mic. I definitely like the look of this. Now we just need to plug it into a computer and see how it works. Up here at my computer and I have the Samson microphone plugged in and I'm just gonna grab it here and kind of show it to you. That it's plugged in and I have it set up just totally by default. I want to say, hello. I want to say that when I speak into it directly, the little LED flashes from blue to red, and I think it is peaking at that moment. So that's kind of interesting. So if I'm talking like this and I'm getting really close to it, I think it's helping you and saying, hey, hey, back off, dude, personal space. That's at least what I'm saying. But it's only about 18 inches away from my face. It's just below my monitor here. I'm speaking generally into it and I'm speaking in a normal voice. So I'm gonna let you be the judge of whether you think this microphone is good enough for your application. For me, I just want something better than the built-in microphone or using earbuds like that when you're on a meeting, recording something. I'm surprised at how bad the audio on earbuds is. They sound fine when I'm on a phone call, but when people plug them into their computer and use them for meetings and stuff, it sounds so awful to me. So anyway, hopefully this is something that will allow me to travel with it easily because it's so tiny, so small, and yet hopefully it will be a much better audio experience for anyone that has to suffer through some of my videos or live streams in the future. So that's the one that's gonna go with me on the road. Whether we like it or not, because all my other microphones are about the size of a shoebox, so the Samson wins. But if you're interested in it because of the size or the audio quality, then you can pick one up too, because it might make your online meetings a little bit better. I'll put a link to it in the description below. Peter Von Panda, out. We can discover more and explore so much deeper. We can live better than